Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome. Today I will show you another PvP battle featuring the Masakado and my new 6 star demon, Purple Thor. I know I am late to the hype about Purple Thor and it's it's likely it's not the hip the hippe or hype, I don't know how to pronounce it. I will just call it hype. So basically, I use the liberator of Aileen because Aileen have something like postscript or something like happy ending passive skill. I don't know. And basically, this Masakado battle just use double intimidating stance and you are Gucci. See? This Mjolnir, I have Elec Arm, I already marked it, you see this, Elec Arm, that's freaking 21 Yasaka Magatama, you know, meanwhile Elec Boost only cost you 6 Magatama, fucking Sega, rip us, the skill, the skill point, see Lucky Skip too, I will just Mjolnir, Mjolnir is really good because it's a multi-hit skill and it can pop endure and kill it if you are lucky enough to strike it two times in the same target. And maybe alien passive has wow this this fucking shit this tank shit team. Are you Sionian? And I use ailment. Status ailment weak. Basically, weak is my Dezoreton skill. I will try to save my my trumpeter to purple because purple have the auto rapuka thingy, and it's good. For barrier brick, yeah, barrier brick, and it's good for I mean, for sustainability. Autorakoka is good for the sustainability of so wow, is that thing have at least mass passive? Okay, Hecaton. Why he else get? I remember, is he really have such a high resistance against ailment? So I can mute it. Oh no, just bad RNG then. Dark pandemic. Dark pandemic is such a good skill because it's like a auto debilitated skill with okay is he drain oh he null that mean it's still okay miss okay defense buff maggie dolaon and this liberator sionian make the enemy cannot recover from the mood state if i don't wrong it because it has something like no talking passive so no talking basically is silence the silence basically is smooth in this game wow my Osiris get wrecked and wow of hell literally Pass. Okay. Apocalypse. Kill, kill, kill. Take okay, kill. It's the cliff hackathon. And my Osiris die. Laser candy. Yeah, laser candy. Concentrate. 
to kill this fucking hecaton dark enemy oke tarunda oke summer come no i can do that pass energy drain nah just pass it summer come soul drain wow it hurt maybe i will try to save my competitor to purple if i the best competitor is when you get it in yellow so you have the gacha skill of auto tarunda and then you save it to purple that's the best competitor that you can get so the best competitor basically in summons is yellow not because the necro dogma skill but because the gacha skill auto tarunda so if you have an auto tarunda gacha skill you can save the archetype to the purple because when you save it your gacha skill not get saved your gacha skill has remained the same as you pull it so the best is yellow that's my solely my opinion so you have auto rakuka and auto tarunda that means you have the you decrease the enemy attack power 20% and you receive less 20% more than 20% less damage by the defense buff from rakuka aja so that means you have lost the 40% damage from your enemy to your monster that's so good 40% really good here okay i just want to make sure this one is die because i don't want to get cracked by the yinglong killer oh fuck that's it to Kulain so basically it's red so it's safe lucky skip okay luck lucky skip wow good lucky skip me only inspiration what why not the happy ending thingy? You only kill. Just, just, just. Not enough. Ragnarok. You only you die. You only in max skill really good because you get two MP recovery back. So it's basically only five MP skill. Okay, all the this combo with Ananta, blah 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 blah. I should six start this um this good luck. Yes, this good luck. So he can move first before so he can use dark pandemic skill barrier break or dark pandemic barrier break or dark pandemic i want to mod that ananta because that ananta have war cry because all of the motherfucker really really lucky there okay Recover one MP because golden spotlight. Okay, bind Elilat is a thing here. Concentrate. Pass. Dark enemy. Rakunda. Okay, Rakunda, get it. Next turn. Oh, 
Okay. Hmm, may gido laon. Okay. Na, okay, Max Demek Apocalypse. Uh, not bad, not bad. Kill Huang Ti. Okay. I'm Gucci. Get salty. Okay. Apocalypse. Bam. Why Apocalypse only has the damage same as Megiddo Laon? 120. Why not 130? Fucking Sega. Oh, maybe because the ailment state that. Okay, this is actually interesting, but you are too fast, so I will wreck you with this comb. Arena offense for me not really a problem because I have a variety of net of a mon of a demon of a team I can use for counter all of the meta defense. But the problem is I don't have that meta defense like Huang Ti, Harlot, Rama, that Reaper Race like Ixtap, that Wall Thingy, or the newly Masakado, I don't have that. That's why I cannot pass of the Diamond 2 because of that. Gacha exclusive demon. Inspiration. Oh shit! In long killer that really hurt. That's why I call that's a cheat. Cause that really hurt. That's a really cheater skill. Oh, not lucky skip. Oh, Babylon Goblet. Okay, maybe that's all for my PvP video. Thanks guys for watching. I basically want to see you my newly toy. That's a purple tour. I fuse it when the 30% cost of my campaign back. If I have the video when I fuse it, you can check my YouTube channel to see how can I fuse the purple tall. Okay, thank you very much for your attention. See you in the next DX2 video. Bye bye.